Number 13. The table summarizes the distribution of color and shape for 100 tiles of equal area. If one of these tiles is selected at random, what is your probability of selecting a red tile? Express your answer as a decimal or fraction, not as a percent. Always, always, always double check their instructions for things like this where it is a student produced response. You don't want to get the right answer, but then mark it on their sheet incorrectly or mark it in the computer incorrectly, I should say. Okay. We want to know what's the probability of selecting a red tile. So probability is always going to be a part out of a whole. So in this case, the part is red tile and the whole would be all the tiles because they're all in a bag together. I'm assuming. Now it does not specify whether this tile must be square or pentagon. It doesn't matter. All that matters is whether it's red or not. So what is our red tile? Well, if you look in the red tile column, it's telling us there are 10 square tiles that are red. There are 20 pentagon tiles that are red for a grand total of 30 red tiles. So 30 is my number of red tiles and all tiles. I'm going to look over here where the totals converge is a hundred. It goes either way. If I had 30 plus 30 plus 40, it equals 100. Or if I had 55 and 45, it equals 100. There are 100 tiles total. And they want your answer as a decimal or a fraction. So 30 over 100 can be simplified. You divide both of them by 10. It becomes 3 tenths. So that would be my fraction. And if I wanted to express that as a decimal, it would be 0 0.3. So make sure to do that because as they say, don't do it as a percent. So do not put 30 in there and say, oh, I meant 30%. Nope. They said, don't do it as a percent. So it's going to be either three tenths or 0 0.3 as your answer. Hey guys, just a quick heads up. I've got some cool stuff coming for y'all, including a free course full of SAT tips and tricks, as well as an exhaustively complete course on everything you need to know for the SAT, both math and reading. So subscribe to the channel to get notified when that goes live. I'm also going to put it in the comments and description below as soon as it does. In the meantime, if this video was helpful or useful in any way, please let YouTube know. Comment, like, share, subscribe. You know the drill. Thank you so much for stopping by. Hope you have a great day. See you later. Bye.